Shalom. All right, I'm going to first begin by giving all praises, honor, and glory unto the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Also, I want to give double honors unto the apostles and elders of Great Millstone and peace and blessings to the hopeful elect, the 144,000 men that's laboring in His work in our troops in Syria, Shalom, Makim, and also Shalom to the one third of Israel, which consists of the men, women, and children that's listening to these videos and serving the Lord to the best of their ability, Shalom. All right. And, um, you know, in this lesson, I'm going to speak about, you know, um, basically, you know, how how this word is a true baptism. All right. And, you know, the spirit hopped on me to do this lesson because, you know, me and my um, Eve, we um, you know basically we went out to eat with, um, with my Eve's um, with my Eve's dad. And, and he was talking about how he just got baptized. All right. You know, um. You know, I held my peace. You know, I, I didn't, you know, I didn't say anything. All right, but you know, scriptures start popping in my head. You know that the, you know, this word is the true, is the true, um, is the true baptism. You're supposed to get baptized in this word. All right, you know, you dump your head under the water. All right, that's not the true baptism. All right, you know, and that's and that's of the world. All right, the world teaches you if you baptize, you know, you, you um, the, the world teaches you, um to dump your head in the water and then you come out clean, all right? But you're supposed to do that, you know, through this word, all right? So I'm just gonna pull some scriptures that I have through the spirit and Lord willing is edifying, all right, to the hopeful elect. All right, so this is Psalm chapter 119 and verse nine. Wherewithal shall a young man cleanse his way by taking heed thereunto according to thy word, all right? So that's how you get um, baptized, that's the true baptism. All right, then you got to be baptized by this word. All right, because you can be, um, because because you, you you can get your head dumped in the water. All right, but you know, and you coming out still the same old wicked individual. All right, still praising Jesus Christ. All right, still committing adultery. All right, still smoking weed. All right, so you're not really. I mean, you, you, that's that's not the true baptism. All right, that's that's what the world teaches you. All right, you baptize and you save. All right, you know that's that's. That's um, you know, that's following the traditions of men. All right, we follow the Lord according to the Scripture. All right, and uh, let's get another Scripture. All right, so this is Acts chapter eleven. Acts chapter eleven and verse sixteen. Then remember I the word of the Lord, how that He said, John indeed baptized with water. All right, you know, so John he did baptize with water. All right, so that's not wicked by being baptized with the water all right but but you but the first important thing is being baptized with this with, with the words of Yahweh Bashanel Shah um worshiping the Lord as the scriptures have said all right and it says but ye shall be baptized with the Holy Spirit all right that's what you got that's the true baptism all right being baptized with the Holy Spirit all right John 6 63 the spirit that is the truth. I mean, um, the spirit is what quickeneth. That's what um, makes you, um, you know, that's that's what give us life. All right. Because without the Holy Spirit, all right, we are, we know, we in gross darkness. All right. So it says, John indeed baptized with water, but ye shall be baptized with the Holy Spirit. All right. And this what these Christians don't understand. All right. They, you know, they, um, these Christians don't understand being baptized with the word. All right. And, you know, and the Christians, you know, they baptize with the word of, of, of Esau, all right? They baptize with the word of Satan, all right? They're not worshiping the Lord in spirit and truth, all right? They're not worshiping the, 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 the God of the Bible, all right? You know, because these Christians, they, um, you know, they get baptized and then, and then go eat a pork, um, and then go eat a pork sandwich. All right. You know, these uh, Christians, you know, they get baptized, you know, but they but they still uh, celebrated Halloween and Thanksgiving and Christmas and all that nonsense. That's that's not in the scriptures. All right. You know, and the, the scriptures rebuke, um, rebuke Christmas. All right. You know, it tells you clear as day not to celebrate Thanksgiving, not to celebrate Christmas. All right. But what these Christians do. All right. You know, they worship the Lord, you know, as as a. Uh, you know, they, they go on to seek their own righteousness, all right? You know, and that's what these people, you know, don't understand. 
All right, this is John chapter 15. John chapter 15 and verse 3. Now ye are clean, Salakia. Now ye are clean through the word which I have spoken unto you. All right, so that's how we, that's how we are clean. All right, we are clean through this word, man. All right, we're not clean by dumping our head in some, in some filthy, um, um, it's, it's some filthy water. All right, and then coming up saying saying that you baptized. And all, man, we are baptized in, in in the word. All right, you know, and and you and you can and you can tell uh, that a man has been baptized by the word. All right, because you know his whole countenance started changing. All right, he stopped um, doing the things that he was that he was once doing in the world. All right, you know the, um, because. That that's the true that that's the true um, um, bat, baptism, all right. You know this world, man. These 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 churches, all right. They are leading our um, are leading the children of Israel astray, all right. Telling them doctrines of of um, telling them doctrines of men, all right. Uh, this is John. Let's read it again. John chapter fifteen and verse three. Now ye are clean through the word which I have spoken unto you. All right, we are we we have been clean through the word. All right, you know you know um you know people tell me oh you brainwashed. All right, you know okay I am brainwashed. My brain has been washed from the from the wickedness that has been taught for all these years. All right, my brain is washed with the truth. All right, but you people brains is washed with filth. All right, it's washed with Esau's lies. All right, it's it's washed with the doctrines of men. All right, the um y'all about to me outside said the wisdom of this world is foolish is foolishness with the most high. All right, so you people's wisdom, all right, your your doctor's degrees, your master's degrees, all right, your uh you know um you know, all, all all you people, you know, that's that's esteemed high in this society. All right, yo, your wisdom that you have, all right, is is you don't have you 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 don't have the answers. All right, you don't have the answers of why we in this predicament. All right, you don't have the answers. You know, you 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 you, you people don't have the answers. All right, the scriptures say, the Lord He revealed His secrets unto the servants, the prophets. All right, so we have the answers. All right, through the Spirit and power of Yahweh Shai. All right. Um, but um, let's go back to the scriptures. This is John chapter seven, in verse thirty-eight. It reads, "He that believeth on me, as the scriptures have said." All right, you gotta believe on your how about Shemel Shai, as the scriptures have said. It says, "What out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water?" All right, what's that living water? This truth. All right, you know we have the truth through the spirit and power of your how about Shemel Shai. All right, we are. We are, um, you know, um, we, we, we making the, we making, we making known in these last days that the Lord is dealing with us. All right. You know, it, it, read it again. He that believeth on me, as the scriptures have said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. All right. You know, we out there on the highways and byways, all right, giving you the truth of the Bible. All right, letting you black, letting you know that the so-called black Hispanic Native Americans, we are the children of Israel. All right, letting you know in the last days that you know perilous times, perilous times is coming. All right, we warning you people of the RFID chip. All right, we warning you of the famine. All right, we letting you people know that you know who the world even called God of Jesus Christ is the so-called black man, and they're on their way back. All right, you know, so we have we have the truth, man. All right, and it says, um, you know, um, scripture. This is Jeremiah chapter two, and verse thirteen. It reads, "For my people have committed two evils; they have forsaken me, the fountain of living waters." All right, so you know the black, so-called black man, Native Americans. All right, we forsaken, we we, we forsaken our power. All right, we forsaken Yahweh Bashanel Shai. Our people has, you know, um, forsaken the Lord. All right, and it says, um, it says, and who and hew down. I mean, and hewed them out of, hewed them out of Christians, Christians, broken Christians that can hold no water. All right, so the so our people have went off and served false, um, false, 
false gods. All right, calling on Buddha. All right, calling on Allah. All right, calling on Haley Selassie. All right, calling on um, all these false gods, man. All right. You know, the Lord has made, uh, he has made a covenant with the children of Israel. All right. We're not supposed to be serving these false gods. All right. You know, you got people, you got, you got the black Spanish Native Americans. All right. The, um, the Judites in particular. All right. Believing that we Africans. All right. Following, following this, this Kemet bullshit. All right. You got people, um, protesting black lives matter. All right. Well, black lives don't matter. All right, you know, because nobody is black. All right, nobody is white. All right, you know, it, it, so let's read that again. Jeremiah 2 and 13, for my people have committed two evils. They have forsaken me, the fountain of living waters, and hewed, and hewed the matter of Christerns, broken Christerns that can hold no water. All right, so our people, you know, they they forsook Yahweh Bashim al Shai. All right, they forsook the Holy Spirit, you know. And and, 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 and and they went to go follow these strange, these strange guys. All right. You know, following the ways of the heathens. All right. And, um, you know, and, and, and our people still doing doing it today. All right. And that's why we in the condition that we in. All right. We the last to get hired. All right. First to get fired. You know, we getting gunned down in the streets. We getting locked up in prison houses. All right. You know, you, um. You know, you got an evil eye towards uh, a black person. Got an evil eye towards another black man. All right, the the Hispanics got an evil eye towards each other. All right, you got these gangs. All right, black. Um, you got the uh, Latin kings and um, gangsters disciples. All right, you got Bloods and Crips. All right, all these are the curses. All right, and so this is Romans chapter twelve. In verse, in verse two, it reads. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. All right, so, you know, you have to be transformed by the, by the renewing of your mind. All right? You know, that's a part of, you know, being baptized. You know, these Christians come out, come out to um, get dumped in the water, and they still, you know, talking about, um, they, they still talking about the same old conversation. All right? You know, they, they, you know, the um, scriptures talk about put off the former conversations of old. All right. These people come out still talking about, you know, um, you know, still talking about folly. All right. You know, still talking about rolling up blunts. All right. Committing adultery. You know, still talking about false gods. All right. You know, these people, man, are, are you know, these, these people that say that they are baptized, man, have no clue. All right, they have no clue, you know, of, of you know, they have no clue what they talking about. All right, they have, you know, they have no um, truth. All right, and this, uh, let's read it again. Romans 12 and 2, and be not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of the Most High. All right, you know, so... You know, every, everything starts in the mind, all right? You know, we come in this truth, man, all right? You, you got to put off the former conversations, all right? You shouldn't be in the truth, all right? And, and, you, and you still and you still getting lineups, all right? You, you still talking about um, having a sex with another man, I mean, having sex with another man's wife, all right? You still talking about um, the former conversations of old, you know? You know, when you, when, you, when you are truly um, born again, all right, when you truly are baptized in the word, all right, you're going you're gonna to put off that, that old man, all right? People are going to say, people are going to see the change in you, all right? You know, because the, because the elect, we are the light. We are the light of the world, all right? You know, uh, to these um, two thirds of the of the Black Spain Native Americans are in gross darkness. All right, these other nations, you know, uh, are in gross darkness. All right, the elect we have the light. 
All right, so Lord willing, this lesson was edifying through the Spirit. And um, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Also, I want to give double honors unto the apostles and elders of Great Millstone and peace and blessings to the hopeful elect, the 144,000 men that's laboring His work in all true sincerity, Shalom, and also Shalom to the one third of to the one third men, women, and children that's listening to these videos and serving the Lord to the best of their ability. Shalom and Thwarayop. The water you have about Chanel Shai to put in the spirit on me, do this lesson. Lord willing to the next lesson, I'm gonna say Shalom.